Thank you for joining me today. As we're in this exciting world of Marvel Snap, we're going to be playing a crazy Red Hulk deck for everybody's enjoyment. Don't mind me while I try to get the game up and going. Welcome back. This is the response respawn. This I called Red Dead. <laughs> Just like Red Dead Redemption. I have Black Knight, Ebony Maul, uh, Sharon, because he is going to basically remove the ongoing effects from Ebony Maul, as well as Typhoid Mary and Red Skull. So, classic card, classic combo. However, we do have a little bit of a fun package here with Lady Sif, Ghost Rider, and the Infinon. So you're trying to basically destroy or uh, discard Red Hulk or Infinite and pull it back with your Ghost Rider, hopefully getting something on the board and activating your Black Knight to get Scar out for pretty much free at the very end of the game. Obviously this doesn't line up all the time, but we're going to see how many times we can get it to happen today. It's obviously a very big combo deck, so it can be shut down, but sometimes just Shuri into Red Skull into Taskmaster Master wins game still. And sometimes just weaving a Red Hulk in there at the very end can win a game as well. So like this video, it goes a long way. I appreciate everybody for watching. Um, but yeah, let's, let's go right into this. So, value of the hand could be kind of bad. Oh, that, that's an awesome ghost spider. Um, but value of the hand could be a little bad for us, especially if this is a destroy deck. But it looks like they're on move. Okay, I agree with that. Um, next card moves one to the left. Okay, I mean, we could just throw this here and then play our next card in mid. Hey, welcome to the stream. Thanks for watching. And we get some Red Hulk juice. <laughs> oh my god. Are you serious? Ah. This sucks, dude. This sucks so bad. Space Throne and Wild World. I don't know if it's possible to come back. That's why I hate playing into unmarked uh, locations. Sick. Let's see what happens now. Dude, we're good. We got Killmonger, loser. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Play Killmonger mid. Do Red Hulk right. Clear their board. Yes, and they're locked up, dude. They're locked up. Mm. That's not what I meant to do. Yeah, let's just do let's just pop the typhoid mary now okay they got my red skull that's fine okay that's fine too and then honestly that we didn't discard anything yeah honestly just throw that that mid or we could throw it here and then hope we win but they're definitely going for mid too so we want to definitely try to win mid because they're gonna put more than four power there there's no way they wouldn't right they're probably gonna retreat on that I, I would I would think they would retreat I don't I don't see them trying to win both <laughs> Yeah, they just played mid. But I forgot we go left anyway. But we're still good. We are still good. I forgot that Iron Fist would re-trigger with Valley of the Hand. But, I mean, it's, it's still all good. This is where. This is where we'll be good. We don't have a one cost. But this. This is fine. Space Throne. It's fine with our hand. That's awesome for us as well. And we can discard the Infinite next turn. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. I don't think we have a way to get into right, honestly. I'm trying to think that is probably one downside of this deck. Come on. Okay, Red Hulk's good. We're, we're low on space. I guess we do just do this. We could play Red Hulk Taskmaster. I think that would be fine. gonna pull 20 I mean this would be enough and then we can just Red Hulk left all right that should be fine is that moon girl yeah but we still don't we still win mid so we're we're good yeah, GG. Victory. GG. Okay, Ebony Maw, not too bad. Um, yeah. Let's get two Black Knights out, honestly. Mmm, we're gonna need one more. I don't yeah I mean um Furon will get rid of his ongoing ability but it's Furon only for in deck though that's true I might have forgot about that I'm okay with this very much okay with this give me some ebony blades dude <clears throat> four two 420 ebony blades <laughs> that's gonna be insane dude Let's see, does it does it register twice? That's the question. It does. Hell yeah. And these can't be destroyed, so I just throw this here. Get another one of those. Do right next turn and then mid last turn. Honestly, I probably don't even need to put it there because I won't have time to play it, but who cares? I'm feeling pretty good. I don't... Can they outscale 20, 25? I don't know if they can outscale that. Um, let's see. Uh, let's just... We could just do... We could do this. Okay, let's see. Four. One. Now they're only at five power. I, I think we're. I think we're solid, honestly. Here's the real question. Now, where do we play this? They could Shang Chi mid, but they're they're probably gonna want to play Death, right? Yeah. As I said, they'll probably pl they might play death here. I don't know. That still will only took them to 26, so who knows? But they didn't have it. I don't think they destroyed enough stuff. You get like three more games in, and then we'll assess the deck and hopefully, you know, see how see how it goes. I mean, honestly, let's wait one more turn. Let's see. Okay, we can't outscale collector, that's for sure. Um, all the other locations. Blood, so we have to play in them to perform five. Uh, yeah, we might as well, honestly. If anything, we'll just destroy this card of theirs. Yeah, that's fine. Mm. Just play Shuri. Sherry into Typhoid Mary, I guess, unless we get um unless we get Red Skull in hand. I'm not super happy about 
this, but we'll be okay. We will be okay. That's for sure. Okay. They're they're gonna destroy the Ebony Mall. That's okay. I honestly I don't even think I needed it really. Oh nice, Wolverine. This is a pretty cool pretty cool like destroy discard package. Um let's see what what did we get? Yeah, let's just play this here. They can't. There's no way their collector can get up to 20. Or, yeah, 20. Because this... Okay, 13. We're at 20. That's pretty solid. Not the best, not the worst. This is 11 at 4. Uh, yeah, I mean, we can only... This is the strongest, because either we play that, there's nothing else. Let's just hope they don't... How many cards are in their hand? Three? You're gonna add three? Yeah, we'll still be fine. I think we're good. Let's see, that's up to five cards in hand. Discard two, so that goes up to seven. Yeah, they can't pass 20, right? There's no way. Yeah, sweet. God, I was trying to do the math on that. I was like, is this possible? But that was GG. I really like this build. I don't have Corvus Blade myself, or I would probably run this. I don't think I have him. Let me triple check. Just appreciate you guys tuning in for, uh, you know, almost half an hour, dude. Thank you. Nothing there. play the freaking Ridley from Metroid real quick. Honestly, they might use like, they might use the, what's the stone that changes the location? If they play that, that would be kind of sneaky. So we gotta watch out for that. Okay, Bishop. That's a cool ass Bishop, that's for sure. Oh, it's hands and deck, so that's even better than I thought. Mm. Might as well destroy the Shuri. Pride Falcon, okay. We're really trying to scale up this bishop, but I think I think we're good. I mean, like I said, I'm assuming they might try to play something on limbo, but Bishop can't be 28. There's no way. Bishop Shang Chi can, but I still think we're fine. Lockjaw, Space Stone. Dude, they have some cool ass inks. Look at these. These are sick. Ooh, they just got a lot of power. A lot of energy for next turn. Let's do this. And then play Scar Typhoid. Where to play Scar Typhoid, though? Honestly, Lockjaw's a little scary, so I think it'd be better to play Scar Typhoid right together, right? Yeah, because Lockjaw might pull something like an Infinite or something. Okay, not too bad. Corvus Blade, or uh, Coal Obsidian, I mean. Nice, okay. Uh, yeah. My math looks like that's pretty good. We could definitely overcommit right to be safe. But they might red skull, or uh, they might chong chi our red skull, so 
I think spreading it out might be better. Ooh, that's a lot of cards. Which one's Kitty Pride? Thanos, okay. Kitty Pride, there we go. Hawkeye. Are they running a collector in this deck too? Looks like we're good. Yeah, GG, won all three. Well guys, you know, thank you for joining. Thank you for watching. It's always a pleasure. Um, check back again, like I said, Monday, Wednesday, check the stream out. Try to get like at least one video up a week. So appreciate you guys watching and uh, I'll catch you all in the next one. See ya.